Do you know what today is? It's travel day. Come with us as we board our cruise out of Galveston on the Carnival Breeze. Let's go. <music> Hey you guys, so I am here in Houston. Um, we are headed out to Galveston to take off on the Carnival Breeze. Um, I have never taken a cruise out of this port before, so this is gonna be new for me. Um, I've only taken cruises out of Miami. So this is gonna be a fun experience and I wanna take you guys along with me in case you've ever... Tell me why I actually took out all of my lip glosses and I only have two things with me, but anyway. I'm gonna take y'all with me in case you guys wanna take a cruise out of Galveston. Um, I'm gonna show you where we park and the process and all of that other stuff. So come along. I'm in my room, <laughs> in my little, my little nook, and we're gonna head out to Galveston to head aboard our five-day cruise. So excited, so much needed. If you guys only knew how much we need this right now. Um, but Jordan graduated and this is her birthday slash graduation trip. So come along and let's go. So I have my bags packed. You know what I realized? I am not the person that tries to take my Sunday's best with me when I go on vacations. One thing's for certain, well, certain, certain. <laughs> Two things for sure. Um, y'all gonna see some repeated outfits. I got outfits I just took to DC. I don't care. Um, I'm all about comfort. So yeah, got my bags and I'm gonna go ahead and pack up, pack up the car. here at the Galveston port you know just a bit of advice come early because we're in January and it's already so many people here and that's crazy but yeah that's our boat behind us okay our check-in time was at like 12 30 and absolute madness there's like no order it's so many people here I don't understand why it's so crowded it's always like this oh my gosh he said it's ain't even the worst. Oh my, I'm oh sorry. Like nobody knows where to go. There's no one like conducting. There's no stanchions. There's nothing. We're just all here, one band, one sound. We're all just sticking together trying to figure it out. <laughs> but we're here. We're almost, it looks like we're almost to where the door is. So hopefully. Everybody's past their checking time. We're just trying our best to get on. It's January. Look how many people are here. running this shit but this is absolutely ridiculous this is insane and they said final boarding is at 2 supposedly and it's like 1 30 and y'all just saw the line I don't know who running this shit but it's out of line out of pocket crazy okay you guys after almost two hours we are finally in <laughs> Say hi, Jordan. Hi. I'm probably gonna use this for my vlog too. Let's switch. Take my clips. Yeah. <laughs> I can't. I can't. I knew I was gonna touch a clip on your shirt. Mm-hmm. Cameras. Now this is the actual waiting room. Hello. <laughs> oh, the Carnival Breeze picture. Look, the picture. Y'all, this was the most grueling freaking process ever. We just trying to get on the boat. It's after two o'clock. 
think it's after two o'clock. And it's still people coming. Oh my gosh, I need a nap. I need a nap, seriously. But we're almost there. Finally. <laughs> oh my gosh. Finally, Jordan. <laughs> it's about, about time. Now we have fun. Now we can relax. So come along with us as we get on the carnival breeze. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, you guys. Okay, we are finally in the room. We got a balcony room. so happy that we're finally here oh my gosh so yeah we got two twin beds and we're on the balcony the sixth floor and it says we need to keep the door closed because strong winds may occur so okay so apparently the lights aren't on so we're trying to figure out if that's normal or if it's not so we got to figure that out Okay, so clearly we don't, we have never been on this ship. So just so you know, to get your electricity on in your room, you have to then put your key right here. Right, Jordan? Yes, and everybody was acting like we was crazy. We didn't have to go through this on the Liberty and, no. and the um, celebration, so. This ghetto. No, this is actually a good thing because it means they're not wasting electricity. <laughs> so no, this was this one was in here. Okay. Oh. Okay. Let's just sit out on the deck for a minute. Let's just take a breather because we are very much. I don't want us to get locked out. We both we both gonna be like. Put the shoe in the in the way. There's no lock on it, so like. Make I don't sure. know. I just wanna make sure. Let me nervous. Put my shoe right there. I need a, I need a something, cause this is, this is wild. Like, this is very exhausting. Yeah. I can honestly say, this is like my fourth cruise. Mm -hmm. I can honestly say I'm exhausted. This was not an easy process. At all, at all. This is not a simplified process. And then people were like, oh, is this your first cruise? No, this is not our first cruise. Yeah, they were like, is this your first cruise? Um, no. Y'all must have been on some really Y'all must have been dealing with a, a bunch of um, unorganized. We not used to this. We not, we not them type of girls. We not, we not, we don't do that. We do organization. We, do organize it. we are very timely. We don't do this. Galveston, get it together. Never on God. There were a couple of nice people though. A couple, like three. 
three nice people. We just talked to a, what was he, a navigation man? He ain't know nothing. He was like, I don't know, that's a great question. I had to ask the man in front of the moon. Excuse me, sir. He was helping. Day one. Day one. We're gonna go through the deck in a little bit, but we just need to just need collect to, ourselves. This was too much. This was way too much. Wait. We shall return after we've had a moment to get recollected. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the bathroom. It's small but efficient. There's lots of storage. It's us having to clean because somebody was in here with some sticky shit and they didn't clean up completely. So now we gotta clean up. I wonder if I want my Lysol spray. Clean this toilet. Victor Amber, welcome to you all for your Cruise line, the most cruise line in the world. We are dedicated to the of the and verify that you have enough white jackets for the number of guests in your state room. At this time, we have to request that all guests who have not taken the cell cluster process must do so now. Once again, we have to request all guests who have not taken the cell cluster process to please proceed with their assigned cluster station now. All guest services will be suspended during the same period. is like this one too. Oh, um, one of the two, and we are going to go on a long cruise and see something completely different that we've never seen and show it to you guys coming in the near future. <laughs> Stay tuned <laughs> for when she gets a job. Right, like a job. And starts earning money. Yeah. And paying her own bills. Right. And then plan a trip. Yes. And then pay on the trip. Yes. Oh no, they're crowded. Look at yeah. that. Good week. Yes. Yes. 
We're so tired. We're so tired. <sighs> I can't wait to go to Mexico. There's so many people on this ship. There's so many people. Like, like, I had to plan the cruise around Miss Jordan's school schedule, but she ended up graduating early, so I didn't even have to do that. So, who would have guessed that she would have passed all eight of her classes? I uh, mean, who would have thought? Who would have thought? <laughs> you know what I mean? We're Paul Rudd. Look at us. Who, who thought we'd be here? Not me. Not me. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog with us closing out eating ice cream. We had yes. a very long day. And after this, we're gonna just rest and chill for the rest of the day, so. I'm done. We'll see y'all. Might get a pizza later. Might get a pizza later. But yeah. if so, I, I'm not, I'll show it, but I'll put it, yeah. yeah. We'll see y'all tomorrow. Talk to y'all tomorrow, bye.